Hello everybody, Ian Robson here. In today's tutorial, we're going to learn how to use the Hayloft building in Farming Simulator 2017. So let's go ahead and purchase the Hayloft building right now. So it's under Placeables, Hayloft. So what you can do is you want to rotate the building. You can rotate it by using Q and E, or WASD will move you forward, back, and all that jazz. Or you can rotate your view by using the left arrow or the right arrow. Okay, so I'm going to place the building right down here. Let's rotate it just a smidge. There we go. So that is the building right there. So this is what it looks like. So this is the side that you load into. This is the side that you get the item from. So in this case, I'll show you a little something to pay, pay attention to. So I have um, a bale of straw over here. And if you notice, uh, it will not accept the bale of straw, okay? So it only accepts bulk, okay? So it doesn't accept hay bales or straw bales. So keep that in mind, okay? So what you do is you get some bulk hay or bulk straw. So let's go over here and if we have some straw in this particular loading wagon. So let's go over and put some straw in here. And if you look carefully, there's a little spout at the end here. And this is where you would load from right here. And as you get close to it, you'll see an unload icon. So there you go. It's unloading and then it's loaded into the actual hayloft itself. Okay, so what will happen is if you want to get your material out of the building, you'll have to go onto the other side where the downspout is. And you can actually load directly into a trailer. So in this case, I'm going to use a loading wagon just to demonstrate it. Uh, so there you go, we've got start filling and you can have straw or hay. So in this case, let's go for straw. Hey, we have straw now. Excellent. So that's how you use the bulk feature for straw. Now, one thing to note is that you can only use hay, not grass. Okay, so let me just demonstrate that. So over here, I have some grass that has not been tedded at all. So let's go ahead and pick up some of that. And uh, let's go ahead and try to put it into our hayloft. Let's see what happens. Okay, so we come over here and come to the unload point. And let's see what happens. Oh, grass is not accepted there. So there you go. So you can't use just straight grass. It has to be, it has to be tedded grass, so dry grass. So for example, right over here, I have some grass that has been tedded. Uh, as you can see, I got the JCB there. So if I come over here and load some of this grass, you'll notice there's a little star in the icon. So there's a little grass icon and then there's a little star. So let's see if this works. So here I am. So here I am right here uh, at the unload point. Let's see if this works now. What do you know? It works. So this building only accepts dry hay, not just freshly cut grass. So keep that in mind. So it doesn't accept when it's green like this, it won't accept this. But when it's been tedded and it looks like this lighter green color, then you can put that in the hayloft. So it only accepts straw and dry hay. So that is how you use the hayloft building. If you'd like to see another mod tutorial on a different mod, leave a comment below with which mod or tutorial you'd like to see next. And I'll use the most upvoted comment. My name is Ian Robson. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, why don't you go ahead and hit that subscribe button for some more tutorial action. Catch you guys later.